What's up, everybody? It's Rafi West. Walking around part of Brooklyn and um, just checking out. You know, NYC has had a ramp up lately in crime. And I'm just checking out all the common sense self defense ways that someone could uh, could uh, fall into some traps. Like for example, I just almost crossed the street because a couple of people were coming towards me, but that's more for to do the uh, social distancing. Even if they have masks on, sometimes I'll cross the street and uh, walk alongside the cars. Now, I was walking in the neighborhood here the other day, and there's like here, you know, we have curb street parking everywhere, okay? And um problem was that there was an individual knocked out on the passenger side of the car, knocked out. On the passenger's side of the car with the window open. Nobody in the driver's seat. Uh, you don't do that these days. You don't do that these days. Um, there's been a couple of really bad incidents of people in their vehicle awake and knocked out. Remember back in the day, I used to talk in my car a lot on the phone. That's one thing I wouldn't be doing these days. Talking on the phone in your car. It's probably a no-no. That's one precaution people could take. For the most part, people are unaware. You know, um, earphones in your ears. Even as I'm walking around, I'm scanning around me. I, I know there's a guy across the street with a white shirt on. I knew that without even barely looking over there. Peripherally, there's a person sitting on the steps across the street. There's a dog barking on the corner. There's three people walking around the corner from where I'm about to walk. Now, one of the problems in some of these neighborhoods here not conducive to self-defense or anything like that is very dim lighting i don't know what's up with the lighting they need more lighting you know that would deter some crime as well it's a holiday so people are hanging out on their stoops um Things like that. Gonna keep walking. So yeah, it was, um, there was a guy right around here sleeping on the passenger's side of the car not a good thing to do and you know NYC I don't know what they're gonna do you know like um, you know I've always thought that the whole system here was not good like uh, you know we have a lot of fare evasion here for example and that could be stopped you know replace those doors in the subway um, also, do away with curbside pickup, maybe, for the MTA and their local buses. Do away with that curbside. There's no security there. There's no police officers there. Make them have a depot where people go. And if there's no ticket, you don't ride. You know? Uh, there's a lot of things they can do. But they don't do it. And you know, this whole pandemic has just brought everything to light. 
I'm not really showing you guys anything now, but I'll show a bit. I'm just walking around. I saw those guys ahead of me a mile back, okay? And so, just walking around. I have this flash on. I'm going to turn it off because I don't want to... I don't want... people who think I'm spying on them. There's not much action here, but that's good. And so, who's going to come to power... and take over NYC. Who's gonna come to power and take over NYC? If the police force can't do it, and the mayor can't do it, should the federal government take over? I mean, it's pitch dark here. see someone coming up my way in dark clothing. And that you really got to be attentive to groups. Wherever there's groups, groups of people, it's never going to be one-on-one -on -one usually. Groups in a car, on bikes, together, excessively covered up. Everyone's a little bit covered up nowadays for obvious reasons, but excessive cover-ups. Then there's a lot of drag racers here who don't obey the speed limit. That's why I think they have speed cameras here. Or well, they should. That's another thing. Put speed cameras up. Start busting people. You know what I'm saying? Car pulling up here on the right. For what good reason, you never know. For a U-turn. But what if it wasn't for a U-turn? So anyway, guys, it's just a little walk and talk, some common sense tips about what you should be looking for. Most people are completely unaware. I always say most people, they don't know what's going on around them. And you should. Maybe some other time I'll take you on a longer stroll with me. But, uh... These masks also help the criminal. All they gotta do is put some shades on and a hoodie. And you got your perfect criminal outfit. All right, guys. Rafi West. Rafi West. Out here, checking out. There's some cameras above me. That's a good thing. I don't want to just point up there and start filming them, but... Person on the right there, sitting in his car. Car's running, right side window open. Sitting in his car. Common sense stuff. 
people. You don't sit in your car and chat on the phone these days. It's just not good because you're stationary and you can't run if you have to. All right, well, this is a low key, low key Rafi West. Just trying to give some common sense look at the streets of NYC. All right, guys? So, um, consider subscribing. Give me a thumbs up and uh, let me know what you think about what they should do with NYC. Is NYC dead forever? All right, guys. Peace.